There is no doubt that while I am in my human form, Karasu will dominate this fight with his power and speed. When I transform into Yoko Kurama, I may have the strength needed to beat him. As for now, it is imperative that I take my time and be as careful as possible. I must avoid being touched by him until my transformation has taken place. Petals and thorns! concern as he walks directly into the massive cloud of rose petals. It's incredible each of the petals is as sharp as a razor blade. How utterly charming. I must say, Karana, they are absolutely beautiful. However, they are also weak and lacking in substance. Traits they must have inherited from you. He's no fool. Why won't he protect himself? In a few more steps, the petals will engulf him and cut him to shreds. <laughs> Things just spontaneously combusted! Be careful, Karama! He doesn't even have to touch the petals to destroy them. He was right. <laughs> well, well, well. Perhaps it was I who was underestimated by you. My hands are not the sole source of my power. They are merely vessels. Poor Karama. It seems you've entirely misunderstood me. Block him out. You aren't able to see my power so you feel secure, but it's everywhere, even in the air you breathe. You can't escape it, it's all around you, inside of you. Why don't you make things easier and submit? <laughs> Stop me, but you continue to try all the same. That's what's so appealing about you. It's a shame that circumstances couldn't have been different for us. But it doesn't really matter. Even things that seem ideal always turn sour. I'm just speeding the process. Besides, I found that there's no greater rush than taking the life of someone you care for. The intimacy that murderer and victim share is unparalleled. Witnessing their spirit separate itself from their body. These attacks are becoming more and more brutal. If I don't transform soon, I'll be destroyed. Like I said, it isn't necessary for me to touch you. It's just one of the perks. Perhaps I should explain how my power works. It's similar to yours in that we both manipulate things with our energy, but with one distinct difference. You can only control things that already exist, like your plants, but I manifest my thoughts into tangible things. For example, the object I'm holding in my hand. Although you can't see it, it is still very real. 
and very deadly. But honestly, I don't think words can do it justice. It's just one of those things you have to feel for yourself. After all, like they say, actions speak louder than words. Now make sure that you pay very close attention, Karama. I wouldn't want you to miss a single beat. Deleterious bomb. energy coming from monsters that act as invisible bombs. How very clever. That's why I had such difficulty fighting you while I was trapped inside. Lucky for me, I found a way to break free from Suichi Minamino just long enough to finish you. That's fascinating, <laughs> but nothing more than a loser's excuse. You weren't able to beat me then, and you won't be able now. Hmm. But you're welcome to try. When you come from the quest class of demons, you find that you can create all sorts of interesting things. These little jewels are what I like to call trace eyes. Once these bombs set their sights on you, they will follow you forever. Ever heard of Ojiki? It's a rare plant found only on Earth, South America. The Ojiki is extremely sensitive to movement. When it senses any kind of vibration, it will quickly close its leaves around its prey. I have no interest in gardening. My, my. 
my, it looks like you're surrounded. What's a boy to do? I thought you'd know better than to corner an animal like a fox, Karasu. We have a tendency to show our teeth. dangerous regularly, and it is several times more lethal and more sensitive when grown under a demon's energy. You, unless you want to be plant food, don't move. Kay! Hello? It looks like it's zeroed in on you. I guess all your trembling must have caught its attention. Um, okay, the table's 180, and now Karasu's running around like a cockroach in the middle of a tap dancing convention! How does it feel to be the one pursued? amount of movement, even something as insignificant as a muscle spasm. So you see, it's useless to run. It would only make you easier to catch. It must be hard for you to lose control. Responds to aggression, so it will be all the more vicious once you attack. <laughs> Um, 
Um, it looks like Karasu's been soundly defeated, and the winner of the first match is Team Urameshi's Karama! Hey, stay back! I wouldn't count me out just yet. Oh, I'm so, so sorry. That was entirely my fault. Everyone, forget what I just said. The fight will now continue, okay? This is insane. I don't know how much more of this I can take. You look surprised, Yoko. Did you think that was the last you'd see of me? Karasu has lost his dear old mask. Indeed he did. Take a few steps back, Sakio. Things are about to get hazardous. Oh. It's an explicit sign that he's internalizing his power, which means the bombs he creates are now inside of him, virtually making him one giant explosive. Are you serious? Of course I am. If my assumptions are correct, he's about to detonate. If you're wise, you'll take cover now. <laughs> Who has no loyalties? He'll kill everyone in this stadium if he thinks it'll help. Disturbing your train of thought, but shouldn't you take this time to pray? After all, you are about to meet your creator. <laughs> you can ask him why he flawed with you. <laughs> Too weak, Karama. You can't even control the most basic of your attacks. Make this easier on both of us and give in. I promise it won't hurt too much. <sighs> Karama! 
Well, fight fans, the suspense is in the air here at the Dark Tournament because everybody knows that one more solo attack by Karasu means curtains for you know who. If you think about it, death really isn't so frightening. Who knows, you might actually enjoy it. <sighs> 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 I think you finally lost your mind. If you come any closer, you are a dead man. I will not be afraid of something that I cannot see! You're just full of surprises, but I thought you'd be more original. You really thought this would work. It's called tact, Karama. You should really consider using some. <laughs> I must congratulate you, though. You've injured me more than once, and that is practically unheard of. That's what I call my mad ball. Out of luck now, you're... say you chose not to be afraid of things you could not see? Well, here's a better look. You know that this entire battle has been an exercise in futility. You're weak. You're tired. You're powerless. You're pathetic. Yet it seems you have a masochistic streak that wants indulging. So, here goes. <laughs> <laughs> Your red hair is perfect for that fiery spirit that I admire. You know that's why I've decided to leave your beautiful face unharmed. I may not be able to keep you, but I'll always have the memory of your face to give comfort. You couldn't have been more wrong about my so-called lack of tact, Karasu. Just as wrong as believing that mark on your chest is only a harmless scratch. The smell of the wound so close to your heart be more than enough for a bloodthirsty plant. You may not think I possess the ability to summon a plant, but you will soon find out that you were wrong there as well. I can summon once more, in exchange for my life. All right. Let's end this.
Nelson. Do it already. Finish him. Finish him. The crowd is going wild here, and rightly so. Karama's down, and I don't think he's getting back up. Ah! Just do it. We don't have all day. Give me that, you big bull. <laughs> energy left. I must destroy him now. You should have stayed down. But I guess that's not your style. Now. I may die, but at least it will end in a draw. dead? Of course he's not! He can't be! Accept it, Botan. He sacrificed himself to kill Karasu. Please wake up! I'm alive. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand. How did I make it? I gave all of my life energy. Of course. Each time I take the potion, the duration of its effects shorten. They shorten because every time I transform into Yoko Kurama, I retain some of his power. That's how I survive.